intervening at 179 High Road, Wilson. We experienced God's moving power in this place from time to time. This is power at work. We are talking about spiritual power. You see, when you receive the Holy Spirit, you're going to become a spiritual witness for Him. You're going to be in power for service. Yes. And you're going to accomplish the task. In the name of Jesus. Then we believe that we have power. But that is not power. Power is not just coming here and shouting and making noise. No, I agree with shouting. I agree with speaking in tongues 100%. But what I'm saying, just to come here and speak in tongues and shout and jump all over the place is not power. I'm speaking about spiritual power. Hallelujah. Through the power of the Holy Spirit. Through the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. But how are you going to get it? Today we notice that many people are denying this power. And even some that had it, they become so complacent that they start to compromise and start to water it down. But we want to preach the unadulterated word of God. One thing I would advise you, don't make this mistake. Many of our men are making this kind of mistake. And some are adding, while some are subtracting. Do not add. Neither do you, you must not subtract. Preach the word of God unadulterated. Preach the truth. The truth alone, hallelujah, is the message. And it will work. It will accomplish that which God has sent it to do. And in every dispensation, God moves in a different way. The Holy Ghost used to be without. Yes, just overwhelming them. But today, we have it both ways. We have the Holy Ghost within and without. Glory be to God. Yes. The world uh, is getting worse and worse because the coming of the Lord draws nigh. But although the world is getting worse and worse, the church is prepared with healing for the rapture. The church is getting ready for the second coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. And because the church is getting ready, the church, we are the salt of the earth. And because we are the salt of the earth, we are supposed to preserve. Yes, because salt is used as a preservative. And by so doing, the church is reaching out. And the Spirit of God is drawing men and women, picking those from out of the world, those that will be convicted through the power of the Holy Ghost and through the preaching of the Word. Yes, and they are being regenerated, becoming new creatures. Hallelujah. Yes, that we who are members of the Church of God, we must be careful that we do not become complete.